Got your front page right here. Maria, good morning. Good morning, Ricky. The front page is being brought to you by Tide. Turn cold water washing with Tide Pods. Turn to cold water washing with Tide Pods. When you switch from hot to cold, you could save up to $150 a year on your energy bill. Plus, Tide cleans great in cold. Good morning, RSMS family. Here's your Wednesday headlines. Just days after a shooter killed three adults and three children at a private school in Nashville, Tennessee, a new report determined that guns are the leading cause of death for U.S. children children and teens since surpassing car accidents in 2020. Firearms accounted for 19 percent of childhood deaths between the ages of 1 and 18 in 2021, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention Wonder database. About 3,600 children, Ricky, died in gun-related incidents that year. The shooting at the Covenant School in Nashville on Monday marks the 16th shooting this year in grades K through 12. Wow. In other news, yeah, two survivors of a 2015 racist massacre that left nine of their friends at a Charleston church told it dead uh, told a group of state senators on Tuesday that South Carolina needs a hate crimes law. They further went on to say that lack of such a law is an insult to what they endured. Now, South Carolina and Wyoming remain the only U.S. states without a law giving stiffer penalties for crimes motivated by someone's race, sexual orientation, religion or disability. Lastly, Ricky, how about 4G on the moon? The Internet is set to arrive on the moon later this year. Nokia is preparing to launch a 4G mobile network on the moon in the hopes of enhancing lunar discoveries and eventually paving the path for human presence on the moon. I'm Maria Moore, and that's a quick look at news. For more on these stories and other headlines, visit rickysmileymorningshow.com.